going on everyone? Sam here with Late Sports Cards. Welcome back to this week's episode of No Method All Madness. Um, we got two different weeks of golden purchases. Uh, TJ, our guy behind the camera who gets all this stuff done, was on the shelf for this past week on the IL, if you have it, to be honest. So glad to have him back and we're back to rolling here. So we'll start with the most, uh, the furthest week away. So that's empty. So this is from, not this, last week's auction but the week before so really don't remember what the hell is in here so i'm excited start off with oh yeah this is going to be psa 9 2019 uh prism basketball deandre hunter auto number to 25. one of my guys always loved deandre hunter plays incredible defense hawks in general had a down year so not don't love that but i like deandre hunter Next up is going to be a 23 Bowman Sapphire PSA 9 Ambiores Tavares. Uh, green Sapphire for the Atlanta Braves. Um, again, Prospect PSA 9 Green Sapphire. I don't mind it. I'm in. Uh, what do we got next? This, one, this one's sticking with me. This is uh, a card I bought for the PC. Uh, 21 Prism PSA 9 Mojo Trey Young of the Atlanta Hawks. All I have to say to that card right there. It's a uh, New York Knicks enemy, Trey Young. Uh, next up, this was a nice little like ten dollar buy. Uh, PSA nine, Purple Prism, Nemius Keita from twenty one twenty two Prism Basketball. Uh, I do like it because it's a color match. Purple's one of my favorite colors. He actually gets some minutes sometimes for the Celtics now, so don't hate the purchase at all. Nemius Keita. Next up is gonna be from the same year of Prism, PSA 9 Blue Ice of Luca Garza, one of the uh, greatest college basketball players of the last, I don't know, I would say decade over at Iowa. Gets some minutes now for the, uh, the Timberwolves as well, so a lot of people saying Zach Eady might compare to Luca Garza. Luca Garza is a little bit faster in my opinion, but I don't know, we'll see. I'm not an NBA talent scout, so I, I don't know. Disagree there. Uh, Give me a little too much credit. Uh, next up, we've got now of the New Orleans Saints 2020 at Panini Prism Football Silver, Chase Young. Extremely, extremely hyped up prospect coming out of uh, Ohio State. I still think he's got a lot of potential depending on uh, you know how much effort he gives, if he stays on the field. I think he'd be a good signing for the, uh, for the New Orleans Saints and kind of approve it here. This one is sweet. This one I'm very excited for. It's gonna be 22 Select. Uh, PSA 9, white blue prism to 299. Jalen Williams, AKA J Dub, of the Oklahoma City Thunder. Um, he's had himself a really good last stretch of games, so excited to see what he continues to do in that super young and promising team in OKC. And then probably the nicest card of the order. This actually worked out pretty well. Uh, this is gonna be a PSA 9, 23 prism draft picks. Red Scope, Brandon Miller, number 288 of the Alabama Crimson Tide. Obviously, he's on the Hornets now. Had like, he was nine for nine shooting about five days ago or something like that, which is really awesome. So, uh, yeah, Brandon Miller. I'm excited about that one as well. All right, now we're gonna go to last week's purchases. This is from the past week. Okay, this is pretty cool, actually. 2020 Bowman, uh, technically it's 2020 Bowman. PSA, PSA 9 Refractor to 499 Jeremy Pena. That is a first of the Houston Astros. Former World Series MVP as a rookie, which is cool. Had a kind of a quieter year last year, but um, Houston's been rolling the past couple of games, so they're gonna be back to AL West supremacy, I'm sure. Unfortunately for everybody. Where's the trash can? Can we bang a trash can real quick? All right. Now we got, what, four more? Yeah, no. Uh, five more. Next one up is gonna be 23 Archives. Not six series, regular Archives. Uh, Baby Boomers, PSA 9 Auto, Bo Naylor. It's a rookie auto. Bo Naylor of the Cleveland Guardians. Um, I did really like this set. There's a couple different cards in that set I do want to collect. Uh, that thought the Baby Boomers was a pretty cool uh, insert that they put in, especially the autograph variations. So, excited about that one. And obviously Bo Naylor, a lot of power potential there in uh, Cleveland. Next one here, 21 Topps Chrome Platinum Anniversary. Set I really enjoy, I think the art on it is beautiful. 
Uh, this is gonna be the Aqua Wave Refractor, uh, not numbered, of Vladimir Guerrero Sr. Uh, always been a big Vlad fan ever since, you know, anywhere from LA. I didn't really get to watch him in Montreal, but I know he was obviously great there. All the way into his days at, in Baltimore, and uh, his card in MLB The Show 23 is, is awesome. Been having a lot of success with that card. Next up is gonna be 21 Bowman Draft Sapphire, PSA 9 first, the Tyler Black, one of the Milwaukee Brewers' top prospects. Um, not a ton to say about that one. Like I said, I do like the look of Sapphire and Tyler Black's a uh, potential call up this season, so excited on that one. Uh, next up, this one's kind of cool. It's going a little bit off course of what I usually do. This is gonna be a uh, 2001 Upper Deck uh, PSA 9 Ilya Kovlachuk rookie of the Atlanta Thrashers, the team that then moved to Winnipeg. Uh, Kovlachuk, great NHL player. I remember when, I think it was with New Jersey, again, correct me if I'm wrong on that, when he tried to sign a 17-year deal and the N uh, NHL vetoed it. So I remember that being when I was younger, uh, a little bit in the media. And then last card of the order. This one is pretty cool. That is gonna be um, 2023 Panini Instant NFL, uh, CJ Stroud. Number two, 2839, so 2839. Um, Stroud sets record in postseason debut. So that was against the Cleveland Browns. I do like, I can't, I can't afford really nice CJ Stroud stuff. So we're gonna stick to the Panini Instant for now. Maybe unfortunately, but we'll eventually get there. Um, but yeah, that is going to do it for this week's segment of No Method All Madness. Uh, this upcoming week, there's a couple cards I bought that I am super, super excited about, so keep your eyes out for that one. Thank you all, as always, for watching, and we'll see you this next week.